It's ultimate vindication for him. He feels relief, but of course, uh, you know, he needs you to understand as well that this is not a case where there are winners. I had told the jury, and uh, I repeat now to, to all of you in the media that, uh, you know, this tragedy uh, took its tremendous toll on him. He was uh, really like family to those two victim boys, and uh, that is something that he absolutely has to carry for the rest of his life. Uh, and uh, as I had said to the jury, regardless of what happens here. The, the reaction of family member, obviously they're disappointed, but uh, it is what it is. And like I said earlier, the jury rendered its verdict, and we're going to have to live with that for the moment, and it's way too early to decide whether or not this is going to go further and appeal or not. Uh, we're going to have to review everything. To take the events of August 5 and to turn them into uh, you know, uh, a suggestion of criminality was such a stretch on the evidence uh, as I knew it, as I still know it. And uh, mercifully, it would appear that the jury uh, concluded uh, likewise, that uh, this is not a case of criminality. This was a very tragic, unfortunate accident.